<laughs> That's great. I don't know about the soup, but I know their subs are great there. Love the rolls they put them on. Good stuff. Good. All mm -hmm. right, guys, tomorrow's going to be great. Good. Then come Sunday. Oh. Not so good. <laughs> All right, hang on. We'll get to it in just a minute. <laughs> hey, things looking good outside right now over Burlington. It's going to be a quiet night. I am happy to tell you. Temperature's still in the 20s, doing a 26 in the old city right now. And it's, well, calm as far as the wind is concerned. So we will take that. Temperatures in the 20s are in a lot of places. A little bit colder in northern New York in the teens. Lebanon at 27, 22 degrees in Plattsburgh right now. Not many clouds to the north, just a few over southern Vermont, southern New Hampshire, but we're keeping our eyes on a couple of systems here. This is going to develop into a pretty strong area of low pressure, and it's going to kind of link up with this system right here, and the whole shebang is going to work its way toward us. Saturday is going to be a fine day. Saturday night into Sunday, that's kind of a different deal. So Saturday, the pick of the weekend, we've got a wintry mix we're expecting. First thing in the morning on Sunday, that's going to change over to rain and then strong winds expected Sunday night and into Monday. So let's get to it. I want to jump past tomorrow because that's going to be a fine day. Mix up sun and clouds. This is late tomorrow night, Saturday night, early Sunday morning, an area of low pressure going into the Great Lakes. And you can see how the mix is coming into our region. And then we're going to watch this area of low pressure right along the coast. It'll start to throw colder air back here and it'll take that rain and change it back to snow later Sunday night. And also as we get into Monday, but what can you expect? Well, on Sunday, we've got that snow and ice mix first thing in the morning that goes to rain, expecting more snow and sleet to the east. And that's because it's going to stay colder there longer. And then by the time we get into Monday, so late Sunday night into Monday, looking at wind gusts anywhere from 45 to 55 miles an hour, that's in the Champlain Valley, some even higher than that. Like Sunday morning, projected future cast wind gusts, maybe 60 over in the Tri Lakes area. Meanwhile, well into the 50s. Take your right through Sunday into the afternoon. Still blowing out there, not as hard as in the morning, but then it's kind of a second round. Really picks up Monday morning. It is howling out there into Monday afternoon. Finally, by Tuesday, this stuff is gone. All right, let's come on back early in the weekend. Here you go for your Saturday. Looking good. Mix up sun and clouds. Temperatures in the 30s. This is future cast. Take you through tonight through the overnight. There's your Saturday. It's going to be a good day. It's a mix of sun and clouds. Then the clouds coming in at nighttime, three o'clock, then 3:30 in the morning. We've got some snow, some mix happening, and then it's already changing over to rain in the Champlain Valley. First thing on Sunday morning, but watch this. Want to take you up to say the afternoon time where everything has changed to rain. The last to go over is in eastern Vermont, and then it's going to go back to snow that night. How much snow? Figure one to three inches, you know, for that first go round. And then the second go round into Monday, I think some of us at the highest of elevations find a little bit more than that. Partly cloudy for you tonight. Lows in the teens. Here comes your tomorrow. Partly sunny skies. It's going to be a nice day. Temperatures topping out in the 30s. 37 tomorrow. That mix snow ice changing to rain on Sunday. Back to snow that night. 42. That's why it's going to go to rain. Strong wind Sunday night and then into Monday and some snow showers on Monday. Tuesday is going to be colder along with Wednesday. By Wednesday some snow is possible. Thursday, Friday looks good. And a week from this weekend, guys, we're getting some indications. Maybe some snow then.